more children than ever before being diagnosed with autism, but until recently, affected families in Ohio had limited options for treatment or therapy. One such treatment, Applied Behavioral Analysis, or ABA. It's now covered by insurance, all thanks to a state law. News 5's Nick Foley tells us some parents believe this is a game changer. Because it grows really super big. Six-year-old Liam Collins describes his favorite book. Bright eyes and eager fingers dart over pages as he shares his excitement. Communication his mother Dana once believed might never be possible because Liam has autism. He wasn't talking at all. Um, he had a lot of aggression and, you know, he was very sweet, but he was still very angry because he couldn't communicate with us. Then Dana turned to ABA, which is basically the use of positive reinforcement to instill certain responses and behavior that are applied to learning, social situations, and everyday life. We can start working with them on their cognitive abilities, their fine motor skills, um, and it's for any child who's on the spectrum. Kelly and Michael DeSillo are finishing up construction on their Center for Applied Therapy and Behavior Services in Mayfield Heights, which as part of the ABA model will employ licensed therapists to create a plan for children diagnosed with autism. I'm not looking at the clouds. I look at the telephone poles. Children like Liam, who went through a similar ABA program and is now mainstreamed in the Shaker Heights public school system. Honestly, I, I don't know that I would try anything else other than ABA now knowing what I know and seeing the results that that we have from from the therapy. Mm -hmm. And under state law, some insurance carriers will cover up to 20 hours of ABA therapy with autism support groups hoping it gets bumped up to 40 hours in the near future, as in nearby states like Indiana. Nick Foley, News 5.